If you've ever played on PC Garden Warfare 2, or at the very least, watched someone else play it, and noticed how instead of their field of view looking normal, it's either slightly stretched, or in some people's case, it's so fucking wide, that the sides of their monitor don't share the same postcode, and the moment they do any sort of erratic movement, it becomes sick to look at it. I don't know about you lot, but I am feeling ill right now. Well, often when people see these, they become curious in how one exactly changes their field of view to whatever they desire. Well, as a proud PC player myself, who has just under 200 hours of experience, <laughs> I know exactly how to teach you this power, as well as how to fine tune your personal preference in terms of FOV. Speaking of which, a disclaimer for this video if anyone is curious. Changing your field of view is not considered cheating, as it is widely accepted as personal preference from a small majority of the player base. Not only that, but many games such as Minecraft, Team Fortress 2 and Modern Warfare 3 just to name a few. Allow this in their games, and such changes does not instantly guarantee improved results. It is something you will have to develop with natural skill level over time. Also, if you think changing your field of view counts as cheating, then you are simply mentally deranged. With the disclaimer, out of the way, let's get started. For this tutorial, there is no such need for any third party programs like Frosty Mod Manager, Editor, or Frosty Fix. In fact, all you need is the base game itself, and where to look for it. As a side note, this guide will assume that you are using a Windows machine, and have purchased the game through Steam. You'll need to locate a file under the name prof underscore save underscore profile. This should be within your documents folder, stored in a folder under the following name. You'll then want to click on your settings folder, and you'll find it right here underneath another file. Now, in order to edit our field of view, we're going to need to open the file in Notepad, as it's the easiest choice to make changes to it. Now when you open the file... Oh my goodness! I know, all these numbers may be scary to see at first, but do not be alarmed. For 99% of these numbers, we couldn't right royally give two shits about. The one we're interested in, is this value right here. GST Render, Field of View. By default, it is set to 70 degrees. Changing this will not trigger the anti-cheat in place, so you will be perfectly fine. Let's say for example, I'm wanting a field of view value of 90. Just simple replace the 7 with a 9. Hit save, and then close the file. And that's it. The next time you open the game, that change will apply. And now you can enjoy your gaming experience easy peasy. But then comes the question, how do you know what value is right for you? Well, that's entirely down to personal preference, but here are some clips of various points in the game at varying FOV levels, as so that you can get a rough idea of how each of them look, and make your own judgments from there. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more shit like this. Have fun.